Yo, what's up, YouTube? It's Hack. Hey, it's about, uh, I don't know, 2 a.m., something like that. And uh, I figured I'd give you a quick evening shot of where I live. And then we'll go from there on different videos of uh, how I actually do this. But uh, I actually live here. As you can see, there's um, buses and RVs and really expensive motorhomes. And uh, here's where I live, right here, man. I'll show you. Sorry for the video. That's it. I live in a 30 foot travel trailer right now. And uh, you can see it's winter. It's uh, not too bad right now. I don't know. It's probably, I don't know, 15 degrees, 10 degrees. Monday, it's supposed to be 45 to 50 below zero. But uh, I live here. There's the Mystic Lake Casino in Prior Lake, Minnesota. Um, this is where I'm staying right now. You can see they got these uh, lights right here. This is their famous Mystic Lake lights. There's something shining up into the sky. That's their lights. And uh, yeah, this is where I've been staying for uh, since October. And uh, before that, I lived in... Uh, uh, campground RV park close by but they closed in the winter so I'll give you kind of a couple shots of the sides I've got all these windows closed off with insulation um, here and uh, you can see here I'll walk up and you'll see there's silver foam insulation same here on these windows here and I'm going to reinforce them two or three times for this uh, cold, cold spell coming up. But I'm totally skirted in. And then I have put some snow up to each, you know, all four sides to kind of insulate it even better. Here I've got a little pond and a casino there. And there's about, I don't know, 20 of us down here living. And, uh... It's hard to see, but you can. There's snow here, all mounted up in the back, all the way up to the bumper. Um, would like to get a little higher, but we don't have much snow. We have more cold than snow. As you can see, that's the back side of my uh, travel trailer. It looks into my bedroom. And we, you know, this guy, this one's here. This one's been here. He's selling it. He's not even staying in it. Anything. He's paying 600 bucks a month. To be there, and he sold it for 140,000. No, no, whatever. We just on. Mine was uh, pretty cheap, a couple thousand dollars. And so that's where I live. I've got two doors: back door, front door. This one's totally closed off, totally insulated. Goes into my bedroom. Um, yeah, that's that's pretty much it, really. To be honest with you. Um, again, it might seem a little strange, and it's going to be a little cold out. I'm a little concerned, but you can see I've got uh, lights in there. They're pretty cool that are on. And uh, this window, this is how I insulate them. I've got this uh, up uh, two layers of that on the top and bottom, and then I've got some of that in between. And uh, it's uh, not bad. It's a little cold. I think the other day when it was 15 below, I was probably, uh, I came home from work at 10 and it was uh, 52 degrees. Turned on a heater I have in there and it got up to about 60 something, you know. So, I don't know, not too bad. But it's uh, much cheaper than rent, much cheaper than buying a house. And uh, right now with my work situation not being so good and only working part time, it's about the best option I could think of so um, again you're gonna see some other videos I want to get some solar I want to get some um, probably some wind uh, turbine out here hooked up for the summer right now I don't have to pay electric where I'm at so I don't even run propane heat it's just all electric heat I've got four electric heaters in there infrared and uh, ceramic heaters and they work great so I've got four of them in there helps out 
right here you can't see because it's so dark but I've got a power unit for uh, my side and I got a power unit for my neighbor's side nobody's here so I'm plugged into both sides for extra heat and then I've got uh, a few spots where you can hang like an antenna TV antenna and that's where I want to hook into my a wind turbine or something you know so yeah that's pretty much it guys uh, figured I'd just give you a quick show of what I got going on you can see to my side of my place there's my cat right there kind of creeping out whining at me right now and uh yeah you know give me your thoughts and some input let me know what you think i know it's a little crazy I'm a little worried about monday being um 50 and 40 to 60 below you know he bow me man i mean it's way colder up where he's at than where i am in I mean, he's 10, 15 plus degrees colder, so I don't have much to complain about. But uh, it does get a little cold in there. Um, yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. I'm going to head into my trailer here and give you a quick shot, and then I'm going to shut it off. And I'll do some inside videos at a later point in time. Um, do some detailed videos on how I have things set up to live in there. And... Uh, you know how I make it day to day in there in a travel trailer. It's, again, it's a 30 foot international travel trailer. So, here we go. Ooh. It rained today. Tonight, when I got off work, it started pouring rain and then it started sleeting and then it started hailing. And it was just horrible. So, my lock is frozen right now. Here we go. Let's see inside. Cats. But, uh, yeah, you kind of see there's my 50-inch screen TV. You know, i got to have some things in life you love. So that's about it. That's really all I can think of. Um, again, let me know what you guys think, and, uh, and we'll uh, go from there. And as I said, you'll see some uh, more detailed videos of uh, how this is all done. So peace out. Take care. Have a great weekend. And stay warm.